Hey guys, this is Richard the Gamer. Welcome to today's episode. Today, guys, I am back on uh, another map from the marketplace, and this one is called Annie: The Rise of Londinium. And uh, this is actually a pretty old map. Um, it's just that I never like I planned on recording it ages ago, but I never really got to do it. And now I was looking at through you know old marketplace maps and stuff that I had downloaded and never really used. And so I was like, hey, this is one, and it seems like a pretty good adventure map, so I mean, why not do that, right? So here we are. We got the rules playing adventure, sent chunk render distance to eight, uh, turn music off and sound on, made by Black Exception, difficulty peaceful, highly recommended to have one to two players. All right, well, I'm one player, so that works. Uh, so we're in this pretty high tech looking building. Well, it's to start, I guess. Hello? Oh, it talks. Hello? Is this thing on? Excellent. The current time is 1.02 p.m., June 1st, 2129. <laughs> Welcome to the Gherkin Tower of Londinium, home of Bella Vita Industries. I am Annie, the personal assistant and artificial intelligence program operating in the building. We thank you greatly for volunteering to help us in our research as a tester, and hope that you have a pleasant day. Please head to the open elevator. Is that it? Is it done? Okay, it's done. Alright. So, um, yeah. We have to go to an elevator, apparently. I didn't realize that it would talk. Um, but yeah. Um, guess that's why we had to have sound on. And I did. I, I read all the rules and everything and said everything, except the chunk render distance before I started this. So, yeah. Um, <laughs> Oh boy, this is gonna be great. I was just like, why have sound on? Oh, 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 now we know. Um, is that the elevator? I mean, it seems to be the only place we can go, right? Yep, ooh, and I made the little ding too. Alright, cool. It's interesting. Um, uh, anyway. Is this the only room we can go to? I mean, pfft. there's a gigantic bridge to it, so I guess this is where we go. Can this guy talk? No, he doesn't. Okay. Ah, yes, over here, tester. Oh, God, he's still going. You are just in time for the start of the experiment. My name is Dr. Lee, and I'm going... Oh, my God, I can't read that quick, dude. <laughs> oh, my gosh. I'm going to be explaining what you are doing here today. I shall be placing you into a simulation pod and using state-of-art state of the art technology that our scientists have been building for many years. This will send you back through the different eras of Londinium. <sighs> okay. You will be able to interact with the citizens of the past. You will not be alone, however. My personal assistant and AI, Annie, will be guiding you along through an earpiece during each simulation. To begin the test, please step into pod 1. We'll locate the data. We must locate the data stars. Okay, dog. And what does this say? Watch out for data glitches in the simulation. Alright. Um, we don't want to go into data glitches, I guess. Anyway, pod 1. Here we go. Stage 1, 180. Welcome to the capital city of Londinium in 100 AD. We're not in 2129 anymore. Things no. Things are a lot different in the past. This group of people is the first settlement that began the great city. Try and find the leader to gain some information on the location of the data star. I think I already found he him. He would be in one of these straw huts. So feel free to explore and see if you can find him. I mean... Most of my records of this area and time are destroyed. So it would be great to see what we can find out about them. Hopefully we can recover from the event. I can barely talk. Because I don't want to talk over them. And just be straight up rude about it. Also, I think my pure BD craft texture has mixed with like the texture pack they forced on. That's a bit strange. I might turn it off in future episodes. But anyway, I think I found it. Because, I mean, it's a big hut and there's a guy here. I saw a little glimpse of him. Um, hello, sir. Alfred Anstey. Oh, pff, give me an axe. Hey, all traveler. I do not believe I've seen you here before. I am in need of some assistance with a few tasks, but everyone seems busy. My name is, uh, oh my gosh. Bro, <laughs> I can't read all this. Wow, that oh, that well. actually went amazingly well. It's interesting to see how accepting and open the leader is. Let's help with the bridge and cut some trees to create some slabs. They should help finish the bridge. I don't want to talk over them so you guys can, like, hear what they say, because, I mean, it's audio and you don't get that min in many, uh, Minecraft maps, but, 
yeah, um, let me know if you guys are fine with me talking over the audio or not, because then I don't want to like, read that as well. I don't even know what he said. We need to build some sort of bridge. However, we have ran out of wood. Would you mind collecting some and help complete the bridge? All right, I can do that. Seems simple. That's why we have an axe. All right, let's go ahead and start chopping some wood. You know, I guess we're a lumberjack now. All right. Um, and what bridge? I don't remember seeing a bridge on the way over here, so I guess we're just gonna have to find it, right? I mean, didn't say where it was. Um, I mean, okay. Guess we're repairing a bridge now. Alright. Let's go ahead, let's do this. Okay, give me that. Yeah. Let's go ahead, make slabs, I think that's what we need, right? Uh, slabs, yeah, 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 so, boom, nope, boom, and then, boom, nope, that's a pressure plate, hold on, wait, how do you get slabs, wait, we need a crafting table, right, and it wasn't there, one over here, you gotta look around, yep, mm-hmm, there it was, alright, I guess we can just make all these into slabs, because why not, right, okay, now, um, I, put, I guess this is the bridge, um, okay. Well, let's just speed bridge to fix the bridge. Aw, oh, dang it. <laughs> that would have been great if I went all the way and then just went back. Aw, oh, that would have been amazing. Okay. Well, let's go ahead and keep building this bridge. It doesn't seem... I mean, I, I'm kind of questioning how this got this broken, but... I mean, you know. Hey, guess we're fixing this now. Job. Yeah. You have managed to fix the bridge and ensure the pathway to the other side is strong and stable. Oh, I am sure Alfred more? Ainsley will be very oh, pleased. Sure. Can oh. I return to him and tell him the great news? Okay. Well, I built a bridge, but I didn't make it so sturdy. Um, you know what? It's fine. You know, okay, we don't need to make it all fancy. They just wanted a bridge across. Okay, it's Minecraft. It's fine. There's no physics. Or no actual physics. So, hello, sir. You've already finished? Yes, <laughs> I have. We came from a land much colder than this one. We began traveling away to find safer lands with better farming conditions. Uh, do, do, do I am sure that you and me are a couple of families who visit seems here. That oh. Alfred is very busy trying to run this town. There is so much to do in these early times to set up a strong settlement. Perhaps we can go and bring the toy to his son for him. Okay. Um, per let me finish what this guy was saying. Perhaps I can tell you more later. Could you take this toy to my son, please? Yes, sir. Um, alright. Apparently a toy to my mother dying is a toy in this world. It is no toy. It is a magical thing. Um, now where, where is the sun? There's another crafting table right there, by the way. Hello? Oh, what is this thing? It's a gigantic machine. Info drive one. Alexander Bellavita. The founder of Bellavita Industries started a company that developed an artificial intelligence programs in 2115. The first wholly functioning AI was born. And 12? I, I guess that's how you would you know, do that, right? This was going to be seen as one of the biggest breakthroughs in history. Alright. Anyway, um, let's go ahead. And get this toy to the sun. What's in this hut? Oh God, they have a head. Really oh. Seems to like the toy that you have given him. Wait, where? I'm where are they? Someone on the outskirts of the settlement, is this making to be? some noise behind one of the huts to the east. Go check it out. Is this supposed to be the sun? If so, where are your arms and legs, dude? And I mean, I can't really say neck because no one has necks in Minecraft, but. Your arms and legs are kind of gone. <laughs> um, okay. Well, let's go find this person that we need to uh, talk to. Is it this one over here? Wait a minute. They said... Uh, oh, wait. Hold on. This person's talking. Oh, wow. This is so much hard work. Oh, hello over here. Hi, my name is Victoria Bellavita. Hello, ma'am. My father is um, a woodcutter. He moved... This young oh. woman is actually a Bellavita. Who would have thought? I can't talk. That 
is rather odd considering our company also has that name. Perhaps there is some relation. Anyway, she needs help collecting wood, so let's show her how to craft a wooden axe to gather things quickly. Go craft some planks and sticks to give to her. Okay, is she done? Okay. Well, <laughs> every time I try to talk, she like just comes in and just talks over me. I'm like, bruh, I'm trying to read. Alright, and so couldn't we just give her this X? Like, I mean, think about it. <laughs> we could just give this to her. Alright. Let's go ahead and chop down this wood real quick. And then get her sticks and a oh, plank. Actually, hold on. Wait, wait, wait. I can just make the sticks and then uh, boom there we go oh pff. well okay i don't think that we will be able to actually stay that long as we do not have much time perhaps you should head back to the leader and let him know you will not be staying very much longer and see if he has any more information for you okay i didn't even bother to talk because i knew she was going to cut me out through that oh i'm just like yeah let's just let it talk and explain what we got to do Okay. Hello, sir. Oh, welcome back, Traveler. I saw that you were able to deliver the toy. Thank you for your great work. I saw that you were helping out Victoria earlier as well. And we need people like you. The next thing is I need is a little we bit of head to the farming area and gather some soft food. food. Farms are not very common around tonight. here, as people are only yep. just learning how to farm anyway. crops and harvest them under the right conditions. I think about four loaves of bread would be good to start with. Okay. So... There's a farm over here. Okay. Just, just gotta get some wheat. There we go. Wait, how many did she say four? Oh, well then. I'm gonna need a bit more. Actually, no way, we're good, right? Yeah, we're good. We are perfect. Peachy. Alright, and bada bang. Bada boom. Hello. Here's your bread. <laughs> this is perfect. The party can go ahead. I think that this will be the best meal the village has had in a long time. Also, I got an extra piece of bread. Apparently. So, you yeah. should head to that monument that he checked out. That sounds like some sort of historic site that we don't have in our records. Wait, where now? Um, hold on. Wait, across the river? You mean the river where I just built your bridge, boy? How would you even get over there if the bid bridge is broken? I almost said bidge. <laughs> Alright. I'm going across the quote-unquote bridge. And that is really a very good bridge, but you know, it's fine. Um, is this the thing? The monument? I mean, it looks like it. Do we just plop that in there? Good job at completing oh. the monument. This thing seems like it will last many, many years. It almost has a magical feeling to it. Look at that. A data star has appeared. We need to gather five in total, and then the testing shall be finished. I have added an exit button back to the starting pod and unlocked stage two. Well, okay then. Um, we got a star already. whoop de doo That's fun. Um, <laughs> well, we did it. I mean, hey, and here's the exit. Um, just okay. We're back Stage at the lap. Oh, one complete. Woo! <laughs> the simulation is working. Finally, I can. Oh, oh, tester. Well done on finding the data star. Onwards to the data. Wait, what were you saying, dude? You were saying something else. Don't just cut yourself off just because I come over here, bro. Uh, you can talk to me. You can tell me things. Is there something wrong? <laughs> okay. Um, to part two. <laughs> Alright. Let's go. Where are you? will oh. find that the settlement has evolved into Stay a small two. village. The also started to take shape from the village to act as protection. I wonder what happened to the wall. Let's go check it out. I mean, this guy started talking, so... Hello, the storm that hit last night has destroyed part of the wall. Oh, well, wouldn't you know? Bellavita's stone axe. We should start collecting some...
some resources from the trees within the wall. Okay, can I talk, please? <laughs> okay, apparently a storm hit, and it broke the wall. So I guess we need to fix that. Let's, let's do that, I guess. Um, should we, should we get the proper wood to do that? I feel like we should get the proper wood to fix it. Also, I was just destroying this. Why can't I destroy it now? There we go. There's like... It's fine, it's fine. Let's just go ahead and do it with spruce, okay? It doesn't matter. Alright, I was trying to use the proper block, but no. Wanna do it with spruce? We'll do it with spruce. Alright. Boom. There we go. Okay. <clears throat> Um, oh wait, one more. There we go. Okay, so, uh, let's go. Come on, craft, please. Meet the world's worst crafter in the world. Alright. Okay, just gonna. Bada bing, bada boom, and then. Easy peasy, lemon McSqueezy. Oh, luckily. We have one last piece of wood. There. The wall is as good as new. Let's return to Daniel Royce. Wow, you are a really impressive builder. Thank you, Thor. You know, got her pretty much from, from speed bridging and cake wars. You know, you should try it sometime. Perhaps the best place to look would be the mine outside the wall. I am detecting it on my radar. It's to the left of the exit of the village. Okay, so, wait, I didn't even get to read what he wanted. Um, you fixed up the wall as good as new. I recently moved here to help the leader of the village build better defenses. There are rumors of the neighboring settlements across the land he wanted. He, he wants, my bad, <laughs> to ensure that all is safe and protected. Could you try to bring some strong material and craft uh, cobblestone? Okay, so we need cobblestone. Wait, how much? Three? Luck, buddy. I don't know if three cobblestone is going to help you build the gigantic wall, but I mean, you do you. There you go, there's your cobblestone. I could definitely use this to make a stronger wall. Thank you for this. Thank you so much for this, I won't forget it. mentioned that a storm hit the village, so perhaps you can look around and see if there's any more damage that we could help repair and gather some data. I can see a damaged roof in the village. Speak to the owner and find out. Okay. Is this the owner? I mean, it looks like it. Arthur Ansley. Sir. Will you speak to me? No? Okay. Well, um, <laughs> let's just go around and talk to people. I don't see this broken roof. Wait, is that it? Is that the broken roof or is that just the design of the house? Is it you? No. I don't think so. Um... Oh, wait, yes, it is him. Hello, Traveler, I need some help fixing my roof. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. I can do that. Um. Wait. Uh, do, 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 do. Could you take some of the hay out of the chest upstairs and help me repair the other half of the roof? Okay, the. Yeah. I can do that for you, dude. Alright, here's the hay. I'm just gonna take all of it. And. Now I need to fix this part of the roof. How do we do that exactly? We just build random part. Wait, hold on. I think we need to copy the other side. Oh boy. Okay, so it's like boom, boom, boom. Um, <laughs> I'm just hoping this is right. It looks right. I think. I think it's right. Is this how it goes? Yeah. 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 I, I got it. I got it. I don't know what I'm doing. Okay, I'm a good builder, apparently, so, yeah. Also, this is gonna be so off, but it's just how it is, because it doesn't look right. Now you got this bar along with these, it's, it's just, it doesn't look right. Okay. Oh, great, and now it's just, I'm just making it worse, aren't I? <laughs> okay, let's go ahead, break that, um, place that there, no. Okay, I'm gonna go with some weird, wacky design, but it'll be fine. Okay. It should be fine. Alright, so this here, this here. And... 
Um, boom, boom. What else? We need more over here. Um, dang it. No, I gotta build it perfectly. <laughs> Alright. I know what I said about not having to be fancy before, but I'm making this as good as possible. Boom. Perfect. Alright, I did it. And then what? You have to return to him. Okay. Hello, sir. I'm back. I, I fixed your roof. I, I fixed it. Oh, no, wait. It's missing some parts. Um, I guess I might as well cover that in. Alright. Boom. There we go. Perfect. It looks beautiful, sir. Let me just return his hay. Also, give me that pickaxe. It's mine. Alright, I fixed it. I fixed it. <laughs> um. I have to just walk around here. Maybe we didn't fix it. Maybe we're missing something. Hold up. Let me go check. Um. I mean, it looks fine to me. I think I built it perfectly. Hold on. Let me go check. I'm just gonna dig out of here real quick. Okay. Um. So. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I'm missing part. Missing a part. Is that it? Is that it? Is that how it's done? I think that's how it's done. Alright. We're good. We're fine. We did it. Alright. Are you happy now? Yes, you are. Okay. Thank you for the kindness. Take this gift of metal. I found it over near the mine while I was leading a ceremony for the villagers. You should speak to the blacksmith and see what you can do with it. Okay. Where's the blacksmith? There's a bunch of houses now, so I don't know where to go. We got a library, I think, over here. Wait, hold on. Hold on, I see a chest. I see a chest. What's in it? Nothing. Great. Good to know. Alright. What's in here? Also, nothing. Okay. Great. Good to know. Um... Where is this blacksmith at? We have a little meeting room, I think. I'm just walking all over the table. Um, I think another meeting room. With an upstairs. A bedroom, okay. I'm sure. Um, what else? I think this is the lumberjack's house. Just saying. <laughs> okay. Um. What we got over here? What do we got over here? Wait, I think I see him. Because usually cobblestone and stuff means blacksmith, right? And a furnace and everything. You gotta be the blacksmith. Yeah. Hello, traveler. I am the blacksmith. Is this... Oh, wait. Is that one of my ingots I see? I must have dropped it by it by the cave. <laughs> I'm we full. should make that sword right mm. away. Get the I ore can't, smelt I the can't English. and craft the sword by Daniel Royce. I actually can't properly English today. <laughs> Alright. Um, also, we got another pickaxe for some reason. I guess it's in case we lost the other one. Anyway, what are we supposed to be doing exactly? Uh, can you get some iron by the cave left to the, on the left to the village? Here's a pickaxe. Okay, so we need to m make her a sword. Alright. Sure. I mean, I don't know why you would need it. It's in peaceful. Yeah, I read the rules. So, why do you need a sword? <laughs> Okay. Iron. I found a piece. And boom. There we go. Iron. We're gonna need coal. Unless she has coal. Then we don't need this. But, I mean, I'm guessing she doesn't have that either. Because no one can do anything for themselves in this world. <laughs> Alright. I mean, you know, they built this wall. But then again, they needed me to fix it. <laughs> so... Mm. They can do some things, but others is just like, nope, can't do it. <laughs> Too lazy. Alright. Um, okay. So, do you not have a crafting table? No, I guess not. So, I guess we need to go a crafting table by Daniel Royce. So, yeah. Um, let's go do that. Also, I have a little bit of spare wood. So, I can make those into sticks. Alright. 
if I can actually properly craft. <laughs> Told you, worst crafter ever, dude. Alright. Let's go ahead. Let's craft up this sword. Boom. Boom. And there oh, we go. Wow, the sword is a masterpiece. Bring it to Rhonda right away. I'm sure she will be impressed with the craftsmanship. See, here it is. The sword is beautiful. Thank you for the assistance. I've been it's been nice to work with another master blacksmith. You must be you must bring the sword to our leader, Arthur. I cannot take credit you for such Rhonda. amazing. Let's bring the sword to the leader. The ceremony will be starting soon. For such an amazing piece. I insist. Also that's that's the rest of it. Just in case you were wondering what I was saying. Alright. Anyway, here you go, sir. Hello, Traveler. Thank you for the sword. You look familiar. Are you a friend of my father's? I need some help. When I was younger, I was gifted a toy, but I seem to have... Ah, uh, the new data that I have just collected shows that Arthur is Alfred's son from Stage 1. He must be talking about the toy we delivered to the baby. Head to Stonehenge as soon as possible and return it to Arthur. Okay. So, Stonehenge. Alright, I can do that. Um, don't we gotta go across the bridge? Also, speaking of the bridge, they completely updated it. I mean, they were like, let's make this bridge fatter and give it more support. The person who built it was trash. <laughs> they didn't even give support or anything. Anyway, yeah, let me stop. Um, oh, wait, a, a, the thingy, machine thing. Yeah, the AI, AI is programming took a turn for the worse as its databank spawned corrupted data, forcing the company to shut down and recode um, its processes. This turn of events became infamously known by Bellavita employees as the event. Oh, is that the, like, quote-unquote, the event that Annie was talking about? Okay. Well then. Um, right, we need to find this toy. Um, where is it? Is it back here? Like, around this thingy? Can I... Can I get around this thingy? It looks weird. Also, there's a chest over here. Oh, look! The toy, I think. Wowza. Okay, anyway. Let's go back. And... Wait, do we need to give this toy to him? I think so. Um, alright. So, let's go back and give this man his toy. Um, <laughs> to be honest, I don't know why he would want it. After. I mean, it's nice to have. I mean, it was gifted to you by your father years ago. So, I'd understand, I guess, you know. Alright, thank you for finding my toy. Please keep this secret between us. Another this is data only... star. <sighs> it seems like we have completed everything in stage two. Head back to the pod and press the eject button to leave the simulation. I have now unlocked stage three. Okay. Also, I get annoyed when she just talks over me. I'm like, bro, let me speak. Let me read this stuff. <laughs> okay. All right. But yeah. Um, stay, stay. Have some food. Take this item as a gift. Um. Uh, yeah, I will not take your food, sir. I will be going. And yeah. So see you later. I like how they don't question what this thing is and why is it here in the middle of their town. Stage right. two complete. What are you hiding, Bellavita? Oh, welcome back, Tester Annie. We'll open the new pod to stage three for you. Phew, that was close. What? What? What was close, bro? Tell me your secrets. <laughs> oh my gosh, Doctor Keesley Lee. All right, Mister. I'll I'll figure out what you're doing some other time because that's gonna wrap up the video <laughs> we've already gone like 30 minutes into this map and completed both pod or er, stage one and stage two so in the next episode we'll do stage three and maybe even stage four and then i'm guessing the one after that stage five and probably the end so yeah uh if you guys did enjoy this map and you know want to see me do it more uh, go ahead, slap that like button, even though I'm probably going to record it anyway. <laughs> so, um, yeah, go ahead, slap that like button if you did enjoy. Subscribe if you're new to the channel, because it really the channel out, and become part of the hashtag Lightning Nation. Anyway, with all that being said, um, I'm enjoying this map so far. Seems pretty cool. 
And yes, see you guys in the next one. Peace out.